Welcome back to Silent Hill 3. We've just taken the train and arrived at an unknown station. Let's find out what's here. Remember the last episode I was talking about how we, uh, the game's claustrophobic and we just keep going down and down, ne almost never up? And if we do ever go up, it's just in service of finding a different way down even further than from where we started, like when we went down into that pit? Well, we went down really far into the subway, it just took a train, and now we're going down even further. Usually when you come out of a train, you go back up to the surface. Oh god. Okay, something's gonna happen in this hallway. Pipe? Yep, that should be fine. Okay, I'm not gonna hit that with my pipe. Oh, fuck! Oh my god, what is that little thing on the ground? Something here, too. Ah, uh, let's take a health drink. I'm yellow. Yeah, those... God, those horrible, like, buzzsaw-sounding things. They look kind of like... They look insecty. Sort of like a, uh... Sort of like a mosquito, kind of. Like they have that long proboscis thing, or whatever it's called on a mosquito. Looks like it's for stabbing you and sucking your blood. But then they also spin around in a really weird way and, you know, just generally look really nasty. Okay, these things I can take care of. What is this hellish place? I have no map, it's just endless tunnels that keep changing from weird thing to weird thing? Like this? This is like, I don't know, a surface tunnel or something. Is that uh, 
It sounded real bad, but my radio isn't going off. Yeah, if I can't see it, it can't see me. Hmm. Can I take that? It's a mace. First aid kit. There's blood... What was that noise? There's blood seeping out of the bottom of the locker. Is there something inside? Sort of want to take a look, but the locker door won't open. Ah, it's better that way. It's not as if there's anything good in there. <laughs> oh my god. A mall. That's a mace, isn't it? I mean, maybe mall's a different name for it, but I'm pretty sure that's what a mace is. Or is the mace the kind with the disconnected head that, like, swings around on a chain? No, it's definitely a mace. The thing with the, like, mace-like tip, but the one that goes around on a chain instead of being affixed to the top, that's called a flail. A maul, though. I've never heard it called that. The side of the locker is badly bent, as if something hit it very hard. As a result, it's impossible to open. There's a toolbox here, but there's nothing really useful inside. Oh, is that a map? Oh, thank god. <laughs> it's covered in blood. <laughs> Underpass map. Is it just always... Yeah, it's just always going to be covered in blood. Okay. Now oh, the doors are really hard to see. They're like grayish. Oh boy. I'm gonna be down here for a while. Mm -hmm. of them. I'm yellow again. I need to get better at fighting them. No, bad camera angle. How did that first one miss? Really seems like that first hit should have hit. Alright, haven't tried here. Uh, this back here, though, looks like it's a dead end, so let's go here first. wine in a place like this? Well, I suppose it is dark and dry. Only one of the bottles is empty. I got a wine bottle. Health drink. Health drink. Beef jerky. I'm sure I'm going to use that. Empty wine rack here. Who would ever... Wait, what did that say? 
The body must have been crushed by something heavy. Wait, there's a there's a body here? Body. I don't see a body. With that, then God, how awful. I don't I don't understand. I super don't see a body. Is there anything special about that wine bottle, or is it just for filling up with something? Bottle was dropped at a corner of the underground passage. Yeah, that's it. Why do I still have these Shakespeare books? Oh, hi. You were here a second ago. Really surprisingly hard to get the first hit in before taking damage. Still though, it's worth it to take a little bit of damage and save tons of ammo. If I used up my my weapon, my, my gun ammo on these things, I'd be in a pretty bad place for the next boss fight, I think. Has that been bricked over? I think that was shotgun ammo. Yeah, it's been bricked over. God, there's such horrible noises down here. I love the sound design for Silent Hill. This is pretty different from most, in terms of what doors you can go in. In most buildings, the vast majority of the doors are either locked or just outright broken and you can never go in them, but here I think every single door that I've tried has been open. Uh, I hear those buzzsaw fly things. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna see how many shots it takes to take him down. Maybe they're pretty easy. I've never tried fighting him. Oh, right, I forgot I had this maul. Uh, like a big round pointy hammer. It's super heavy, but at least it's got some oomph. Yeah, hold on. Get away from that damn racket. Let me test the attacks of this thing out. It is extremely long. Oh, I love the animations for it. Yeah, I was worried they wouldn't make it feel very weighty and they would just give it the animations of the pipe. But no, it's like Heather can like barely lift it up. Which makes sense, because this thing would be really, really heavy. I mean, I'm pretty sure the end would be just like a solid steel or whatever kind of metal. Just like a solid metal ball. And that alone would be super heavy. It's like a little cannonball. Oh, it's coming closer. So just a single attack if I'm trying to do fast. Can I do a heavy? <laughs> yes, I can, but it's real slow. Okay, so there's just two attacks. Fast, which is slow, and then strong, which is super slow. Dare I try. Oh, fuck, I hate that noise. Uh... Okay. <laughs> It just like went through it or something. I don't know. Uh, shotgun. Uh, 
Oh god, what the hell? They're on the ground. Uh... Oh, those noises! Should I melee them? I'm gonna try. Fuck. Okay, no, 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 no. Not working well. Too slow. These are, yeah, these are definitely run away or shoot. Wonder if they would like beef jerky. I'm gonna shoot him with a pistol. Actually, do I even need to? No, I really don't need to. I'm just gonna run past them. God, they're terrifying. Their noises, their movements. pipe that I could hold. Maybe dual wield some pipe? I like how they just have these huge, long, empty tunnels where I just know something's gonna happen, but then it seems like stuff usually doesn't happen. So it's just there to stress you out. But probably one of these days, something will actually happen. Hold on. Let me check something. This hallway is sort of... mirrored. So look at this. This is back where I came from. There's this, like, old paper on the ground in the corner, and then there's this pipe right here. Yeah, and then on this side... Well, I guess it's not quite mirrored. The paper looks a bit different. The pipe is there. There's also this electrical junction box back here that isn't on the other side. Probably nothing. <laughs> okay. Well, I missed some stuff back here. It's like four doorways that I haven't tried back here. And a couple over there on the left. Let's do that before I start wandering off towards the blood stain on the map and all that. was that? Oh. So I gotta go all the way around to get back there. Alright, I ran back here. Let's try over here to the left first. Okay, so that's not happening at all. Uh, there is this door up here, though. That would lead into the same hallway from that hallway up there. Nope, there's another fence right in the way, so you can't quite get to that door. Okay. So I haven't tried either of these two doors. Should I try them all? I'm gonna keep trying it. Uh... We're at a stalemate, apparently. <laughs> I 
Okay, okay, okay. like heartbeat noises. I don't think that's my health. No, my health is pretty fine, although it could be a bit better. Oh yeah, nice and blue. And now I'm back to this hallway. Okay. Uh... Yeah, time to go back down the super long hallway. Okay, I'm back here. Up or to the right? Whoops. Let's go up. And then to the left. There's stuff all over, but definitely nothing worth bringing along. Let's go to the right then. I don't know if that's actually an ambient noise. It kind of sounds like something's trying to get out. Somewhere in the distance, though, not like this door right here, but close ish. What is it? Okay, I can deal with that. No, no, camera, come on. Okay, yeah, great angle. Looks like a, a wench. Wench? Winch? It's winch. Wench is something else. What kind of machine is this? Looks like it doesn't work anymore. Sounds like water down there. Flashing around. Looks like a hoist on off switch. Will you throw the switch? Sure. Nothing happened. I wonder if it's broken. Oh, does it need gas? This might be the fuel tank. There's nothing in it, though. Yep. And I don't have any gas, right? Got a. Is this an empty wine bottle or just... doesn't say empty. I think when I picked it up though, I think Heather said there's one that's empty. And I assumed that that was what was picked up. Not that wine would do as fuel anyway. Yeah, I'm not going down there unless it's a last resort. Shotgun shells. Fire extinguisher. Don't really need to take that. Walker's filled with junk. 
No, it's not junk. It looks like somebody's stuff. I'm wondering where a save point is. Haven't seen one in a long time. Something scribbled all over the blackboard, but it's faded and hard to read. Doesn't look important anyway. Oh, there we go. Ooh, what's this? There's some kerosene left in the heater, looks like. If I had some sort of container, I could take it with me. That's probably what the wine bottle's for. Oil-filled bottle. Oh, new friends. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. I can't take on four at one time. Um, most likely this door down here probably won't open, but I want to check just to make sure. Oh. Oh. What the fuck's in here? Oh, this is a big place. Um. I think I'm gonna go back and turn on the thing. Oh, no, 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 no. That left something up somewhere? Where? Was that in a different room? It goes over there, and then it goes down somewhere. Maybe a different room? Thanks to that thing, all the water's finally drained out of the hole. Looks like I'll be able to get down there now, if I can stand the smell, that is. Oh, well... I... So I guess it drained the thing? Or... I don't know. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't want to be down here. Hmm. Is that me? Yeah, that's my own footsteps. Oh, it's very squelchy. Oh, this takes me to the other map. Well, then I probably need to explore this up here, huh? There's gotta be something there, right? Well, I just saved it again, and I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm gonna go explore this area down here to the right. And then I'm going to go down to the creepy, squelchy, watery hole. <laughs>